Grayson Chrisley did not hold back on his latest appearance for Savannah Chrisley's podcast, Unlocked. The 17-year-old son of Todd and Julie Chrisley opened up claiming that prison for his parents is worse than them dying. The Chrisley family has been in the spotlight for quite some time now, even though parents Todd and Julie are serving time in prison for their tax fraud scheme. However, thanks to their children, the family name keeps popping up in the press as the family continues to vocalize their concern for Todd and Julie Chrisley's unfair treatment behind bars. Dan Lewani reporting with all the details. Son of popular reality series parents, Grayson Chrisley did not hold back in his appearance on sister Savannah Chrisley's podcast. The two siblings opened up about how they are coping with their new family dynamic, seeing that some of their family is just no longer with them on a day-to-day -day basis. To me, it's worse than them dying because they're here, but they're not here. So like, no, it's you just don't get to time that's being wasted. At least you, like, I'm saying like, if they died, you know, there's no possible way for you to get any more time with them. It's like it's you over. Yes, the entitled son claims that it feels like their parents have left their lives completely, but it does not stop there. In the near 40 minute episode, Grayson mentions how unfair it is to be separated from his family at this time. The star stated, quote, you know that no time is being wasted, but now they're here, but they're not here, so all that time is being wasted. Now the two siblings bonded in the episode on how difficult it really is to see a parent supporting you from behind bars, but the two also argued on how it is really just impossible to keep up with seeing their parents at both prisons. Savannah, who has been the primary guardian for Grayson and her niece Chloe, has been juggling raising the family while her parents are away. She and her brother are attempting to make sure one parent has a visitor every weekend, but it has its challenges. Grayson clarified in the podcast that it's not that he doesn't want to go, but he also noted that he's just 17 and wants to live his life. He said he feels, quote, bad when he doesn't visit, but knows his parents want him to, quote, live your life. Grayson also admits that he feels guilt and depression after seeing his parents every week. The son says that he repeats a cycle of excitement and sadness within the days leading up to and after seeing Todd and Julie Chrisley. The Chrisley Knows Best star even noted that he is soon to be turning 18 years old and joked about starting an OnlyFans to make ends meet. However, the brother of Savannah Chrisley also mentioned in the podcast how he wants the simple things in life like wanting a Ninja Creamy for his birthday. Now, previously, Savannah opened up that her mother recently handed 30 to 40 handwritten letters after visiting her in prison. And within those letters contained Julie's daily accounts and how she truly feels about missing her husband, Todd. Savannah Chrisley stated, quote, she actually sent me 30 to 40 days worth of letters. It was just like her daily diary journal. I'll eventually put them out, read them at some point to give people updates on how they're doing and what was going through their minds. In recent headlines, the two parents have allegedly not spoken to each other since serving their time in prison as well. Savannah mentioned in one episode of her podcast, quote, I don't think there's a single letter that goes by that she does not say how much she misses my dad. They don't get to talk. So we're like, what, four months in almost and being together almost 30 years and not going a day without speaking to now going on four months is a lot. Todd is currently serving 12 years in federal prison in Pensacola, Florida, and Julia is serving seven years in Lexington, Kentucky, following their convictions in their tax fraud case. Savannah mentioned she spends upwards of seven hours at times with her parents when she does see them, which can be taxing from having to make those long drives to their respective prison facilities. Now, obviously, we'll keep you updated as it seems like we're reporting on the Chrisleys more and more these days, but for more trending news, find us what's trending.com.